Your suffering is not in vain, for it is written in the book of Matthew. 10, 34 through 39. He comforts us with his words and tells us, Do not think I have come to bring peace on the earth. I have not come to bring peace, but a sword of division between belief and unbelief. For I have come to set a man against his father, and a daughter against her mother, and a daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law, and a man's enemies will be the members of his own household. When one believes and another does not. He who loves the father or mother more than me is not worthy of me, and he who loves son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. And he who does not take his cross, expressing a willingness to endure whatever may come and follow me, believing in me, conforming to my example, in living and in, if need be, suffering or perhaps dying because of faith in me, is not worthy of me. Whoever finds his life in this world will eventually lose, lose it through death. And whoever loses his life in this world for my sake will find it that it is life with me for all eternity. So we all struggle. Many of us don't have any blood family left, but only brothers and sisters in Christ. So your struggles are not in vain. Take comfort in his word. It is written this way. Always agape.